When two people have intercourse, there is always one other present. But this other takes on a form that cannot be described. It is the trauma itself, the witness. Why do you always carry so much junk about with you? You never read when you're out anyway. C'est mes fétiches. Huh? It means that it's in case I get stuck to something to think about. Yeah. You think too much. Mm. Let's get on the boat. I'm not going to hang about for George. Yeah. It is between, and it is excluded. A noise that breaks the enigma of the night. A mirror that refuses to confirm existence. An encounter with a form of sexuality that signifies death. Paris Commune's about, but what about the ghost story? Ah, oh, it's about the origin of religion, magical ways of thinking, as conversations. It's about cults and rituals. And what about the story of H? It's not for you. I'm afraid you're not old enough. You better tell me or I'll chuck you in. Try this to see what happens. Okay. It's very sexual. It's about a perversion. What's the difference between a cult and a perversion? I don't know what the difference is, but I know they've got the same feeling in some strange way. You know what? I read something erotic. And when I read them at my anthropologic work, I really feel I'm there. What happens? Um, C'est une histoire sexuelle. C'est une histoire sadomasochiste. But it's more interesting than that, though. Well, what happens? Everything. Is the woman who tells the story the one who plays the part? Yeah, that's her. Is that the man on the back of the book? And is that the woman on the front? With only the text between them? Is it about rising above excitement and falling beneath despair? What? Is it about a condition beyond agony where they've abandoned themselves completely? Oui. Do they fuck in silence or do they hide themselves in noise? Oui, both. Do their strange sexual actions have the feel of a primitive ritual? Oui. Are there ten men watching what's happening? And are there ten women watching them? Does she like it and hate it at the same time? And does he hate it and like it? Oui, always. Do they continue until they're beyond exhaustion? Does she pretend to look at him with tenderness? Oui. Does he degrade her without compassion? Oui, of course. Tell me. Does she enjoy it all in a real sort of a way? Oh, shut up, you fool! Well, excuse me for having a hard on. Go over there and play with your fucking weather forecast. We don't need your comments. Fuck off, you perverts. Do they mark her skin? Mm. And do the marks on her skin feel like her real self or a feed from the encapsulation of her body? Mm. Do they brand their initials onto her skin and does she come with each letter and twice with each word? Mm. Do they pay her for giving herself to you? No, they don't pay her. They don't know how much to pay such a perfect image of themselves. That's why, in some ways, she triumphs over them, for really they became the victims of their own victim. But there's one thing I left out. She couldn't see any of this, for she's completely blind. And the thing they fear most is that she could see in spite of her blindness. Oh, God. Oh, George, can't you fuck off and leave us in peace? Go out and get us some money and you can take that thing with you. Screw you two, I'm going into town. Need a long walk to cool down. Isolated shower, 1024, rising. 1024, rising. 
1024 rising. 1024 rising. Blame him for being pissed off. Sure, it's his own fault. He always wants to hang around. His trouble is he doesn't know who he is. Fuck, what a shit I am. Too broke to buy and too scared to steal. Fucking hell, they're right. I am such an ugly fucker. Not ugly in a strong way, but just a weakling. I'd like to change my bone structure, but there's nothing I can do about that. I wish I could change my skin, but that would be too expensive. It's the way I move that betrays me most. I walk like a turd. <laughs> if I wasn't so tense all the time, I probably wouldn't act like a court fucking jester. God, I need a screw. What the fuck am I going to do? Fuck it, I'll buy a suit. That'll show them who's a castrato. Piss heads, piss heads, piss heads. Look at that filthy animal trying to scratch himself clean. No amount of scratching can take his scurvy away. How can anyone think of touching him? She was right not to touch him. But she's worse in many ways. She's falling apart before his eyes, but he can't see it. They're both in decay because they're killing each other. They can't change it now. Not once the process has begun. began when the women told each other stories about the sexual prowess of their ancestors. They were supposed to believe that they were alone, but all the time they were being overheard by a man dressed up as a wild pig. Fuck, someone's on the crossing. On realizing they had been overheard, they tried to send the man away, but he returned dressed up as a jaguar. Then in order to keep their secrets, they played a trick on him. They said, Jaguar, are you really one of the ancestors? Tell us how it was then, when you got up to your games with the women. The jaguar said he'd showed them, and they encouraged him to begin. But when he was off guard, one of them killed him. The jaguar then turned back into a man again, but couldn't remember any of the conversation that had taken place between the women. Right. Now we're going to act something out here. I've been planning this for some time. You wanted to play? Well, now you've got two parts in my play. You know what's going to happen, don't you? Mm. Hmm? 
We're gonna watch ourselves in the mirror. And you are gonna watch us watching ourselves in the mirror. Over no, there. not that, not and that. And we're gonna watch you watching us watching ourselves. No, no, watching us. <laughs> How can you talk about things like this after what happened? What else is there to talk about? I've forgotten everything that happened here already. Anyway, how could it have happened? It doesn't make sense. Well, I suppose that's true. It doesn't seem possible. The only thing I can't forget is the smell. It'll be here for days. We better wash it off. I've got an idea about this now. Now that's it. They won't know what it is anyway. It smells like summertime. I wish it was summer now. Mm. 